Good morning, students. It's me again, Teacher Jaylene, your teacher in MAPE. So, today, class, we're going to proceed now to physical education. PE stands for physical education, which means pupils do physical exercises or sport. PE is an abbreviation for physical education. So, kids, yung PE or yung physical education, ito po ay madalas natin makikita sa school o pinapagawa ng isang PE teacher. May mga position o simple exercises na pinapagawa sa mga student or sa mga mag-aaral. Okay? So, the first basic positions and simple exercises in this lesson is standing position. What is the meaning of standing position? Standing, also referred to as orthostasis, is a human position in which the body is held in upright or orthostatic position and supported only by the feet. Although seemingly static, the body rocks slightly back and forth from the ankle in the, sag in the sagittal plane. So, yan po yung meaning ng standing position. Next is sitting position. Next is sitting position. Sitting with a straight back and shoulders will not only improve a person's physical health but can make them feel more confident. Many people spend the majority of their days sitting down as they tend to sit when when commuting, working in an office or studying and relaxing at home. Prolonged sitting can cause a range of adverse health effects including bad posture and back health. So kapag sobrang tagal po nating nakaupo, may possibility po na magkaroon ng bad posture and alam niyo yung kukuba ka magiging kuba dahil sobrang tagal ng umupo. What is good posture? What is good posture? Good posture means that the key parts of a person's body are correctly aligned and supported by the right amount of muscle tensions. So, may mga correct posture tayo na makakatulong sa atin. Reducing strain on the body during movement and exercise. Reducing wear and tear on the joints, muscle, and ligaments. Maintaining balance while moving and exercising. Improving spine health. So, that's the correct posture that can help us. So, that's the correct posture of sitting. Next is kneeling position. Kneeling position is a basic human position where one or both knees touch the ground. It is used as a resting position during childbirth and as an expression of reverence and submission. It is common to kneel with one leg and squat with the other leg. Next is lying position. Lying position, lying on the back on the ground with the face up. Lying on either side with the body straight or bent, curled forward or backward, the fetal position is lying or sitting curled with limbs close to the torso and the head close to the knees. Last is walking position. Most of us likely don't give much thought to how we walk or whether we are walking correctly. But knowing how to walk with the right technique and good posture can help. Keep your bones and joints aligned properly. Decrease wear and tear on your joints, muscles, and ligaments. Prevent back, hip, neck, and leg pain. Reduce muscles, aches, and fatigue. Reduce the risk of injuries. Improve your balance and stability. Walking with the right technique and posture isn't difficult, but it does involve being mindful of how you move.